want the answers to this round? Of course you yes, do. Yes, please. No, okay. Barford. <laughs> Fine. Take that asked you uh, which rule Keith Richards, Charles Kennedy and Pete Doherty publicly flouted this year. What have you all put? Smoking. Smoking, smoking ban. ban. Smoking ban. <laughs> It was a smoking ban. It by was the a smoking ban. Smoking, smoking ban. There you go. Bam, bam, bam. Bit of crimping for you. Yeah. That was crimping, wasn't it? Explain to Rob crimping that he's so angry. Let me, Jonathan, do a bit of crimping for the two boys. Yeah. Crimping. Smoky, 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 smoky. Put it in your mouth and you go choky, choky. That's why they ban it. Oh, can we get a proper bit of crimping off you? Come on, come on! Oh, miso, miso, oriental prince in the land of soup. Crouton, crouton. Crunchy friends in a liquid broth. It's not like I was bullying you to crimping. It works so much, we do a whole album together. OK, uh, Ross and Noel, you've gone for? Which question? The first, first one, question, yeah. we've just simply answered it. And also, we did find time to label everything on our table. <laughs> Banana, <laughs> lid, broken paper and a cup there. Also, Noel has fashioned banana battlements and also a great dancer. Banana battlements. So if I try to attack you now... You better get the arrows through these gaps here. <laughs> and let's go back and take that for the answer. The answer is... The smoking ban. <laughs> Brilliant. Okay. Mark, Mark Owen's quite sweet, isn't he? But they wouldn't let him speak because he would have said the smoking bag. <laughs> <laughs> okay, in the Crown Gate affair, what did the Queen appear to be cross about? What did you come up with? Being told to take off her dressy crown. That is pretty much the correct yes. answer. What did you go for, Jonathan Lynn? Wearing the crown. crown. Okay, I'll, I'll go with that. You get a point for that. What have you gone for, Nolan Russell? Angry about edit because it made her look cross. Being cross doesn't, because I said, why was she cross? Well, I remember the Queen being vaguely cross about something, but I thought that might have been when I met her and I did inappropriately touch her. <laughs> oh, yeah, you met her recently. What did you uh, think she made of you? Did she know who you were? We connected genitally. <laughs> We got on quite well. She seemed like a sort of a, she seemed like a nice lady, kind of like all regal she were, all sort of looking <laughs> at you. So the Queen was all regal. <laughs> you found her surprisingly posh, did you? She ever so posh up herself quite a bit. <laughs> I know, she got tickets on herself, this bird. Why did you neck in love? Is she sick? <laughs> What did you actually say to her when you met her? When she, cause they present you to her at the Royal Writers' Show after they go and they go, this is Russell Band, he is the cheeky Dickensian comedian. What did you say to her back? What did you say? I goes, you know that fella broke into your house, you want to get your door mended, love, so I'll be right in. <laughs> and did she look hopeful? She just she went, fingers crossed, you silly ass. <laughs> Uh, well, I can tell you the answer to this uh, was she was told by photographer Anne Leibowitz to remove her tiara. It's the correct answer. I asked you what a plethora of MPs admitted to in July of this year. What have you all written? OK, Rob and David, that my favourites. Uh, smoke dope. dope. That is the correct answer. OK, Lily, Jonathan? We didn't know, so we wondered whether they admitted to having a quick shufti in the House of Commons. <laughs> you thought they admitted to masturbating in, in the, the House, House of Commons? Commons? Possibly, yes. It's you would, wouldn't you, though? If you were. I've, I've, I've been into the House of Commons and at no point did I get an erection. Yeah, but if you had to work there all the time... If I had to work there all the time, of course, yeah, I'd be knocking one out left, right and centre. <laughs> yeah, and also, the people that do work there are aroused by power. So they see a statue of Lloyd George and that really does it for them. <laughs> Nolan Russell, what answer have you given? We put, they all admitted to smoking dope uh, while they were students. <clears throat> I think... Is that what you put? I knew that cape would come in handy eventually. Yeah. Put that. We just put, they all admitted smoking dope while students. We put it on our pad, it came out on the computer, unless ah, there's been a terrible glitch. Bryden's <laughs> changed it. Because it seems to say none of them are actual secretaries. Yeah, <laughs> secretary, foreign secretary, home secretary, ask them to do some typing, they can't do it. You should get a point for that, that was a, nearly a proper joke. <laughs> okay. So the correct answer is, yes, they all uh, admitted to smoking cannabis. OK, um, what was the surprise end to the Bolivian parliamentary debate? They started fighting. That, that, that is the exact 
Right answer, I think. What, what have you gone for, Jonathan? Well, we put uh, they took loads of hooter, chop and pop. Rugs, gack, chop and pop. That's just the way we roll. We know all the words for the white juice. <laughs> <laughs> them, them stuff that them use okay, in Bolivia. What, what, have you, uh, what have you gone for, Nolan Russell? It ended in violence, we thought. I think it's the correct answer, put in a very sort of poetic That's way. That's rather lovely. Let's, have, let's have a little look. This is the Bolivian Parliament. Really this is like our Bolivian House of Commons. Mm. Yeah, but it might have been. <laughs> Did you see that fat man in the blue? He was really punching someone and then he got kicked <laughs> and he'd had enough. He tried to back <laughs> off. And then a little man came with really fast fists. And then you could see the big man was going, all right, I came in too strong. Leave <laughs> <laughs> me, leave it out. Imagine if Gordon Brown did that to Cameron. I mean, he would just Amazing. like win with a landslide then. <laughs> it would just be like, all this rubbish that's happening now it shows be they, over. They that's give a this... shit, don't they, in Bolivia? Whatever they're arguing about <laughs> matters to those yeah, guys. Exactly. <laughs> Nobody gives a shit in our parliament anymore, do they? They're no, just thinking it's... about wanking off over a statue of Lloyd George. <laughs> <laughs> That's passion, isn't it? Yeah. yeah. OK, yeah. Jon Snow read out a new story based on the lyrics of a 2007 hit song. What was your answer? Oh, the Umbrella Song by Rihanna. Mm -hmm. Correct. What did you go well, for? It's just... Umbrella. Umbrella, yes. Umbrella. umbrella, and you've got... Umbrella. umbrella. Ella. Is the correct answer? Yes, you get a point. Now time for another bonus round, and this one is about the best internet viral videos of 2007. OK? One of the year's biggest viral videos featured the inmates of a prison in the Philippines taking part in a rather unusual form of rehabilitation. What was it? <laughs> so there's a viral video that people sent on their computers to each other, and it was people doing a kind of rehabilitation. What, what was that rehabilitation? What do you think they might have been doing in a prison yard in the Philippines? Right. <laughs> OK, let's have a look and see what you put for this. They all dance to Thriller by Michael Jackson, just like the video. <laughs> yeah, we put dancing to pop routines, and I've started drawing Spider-Man. <laughs> and uh, Noel and Russell, you've gone for... We've subverted the format in a very literal way <laughs> by turning... Like, it's all upside down now. Yeah. And we've you've written... Why? Why? Is it? <laughs> it's upside down. Or is it... Yeah. <laughs> 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 And does that get us a point if it is Yahoo? Okay. Let's have a look and see what the viral video was. choose which one got to be Michael Jackson. He was the one that had done the worst crime. That's how they decide. The one that had done something really bad. <laughs> OK, here's a photo of little Zoe. She became a YouTube mm. sensation following her distress over whose retirement. Is that a tear on her cheek or a diamond? <laughs> That's a diamond. She's That's crying because the person at the hospital who removes embedded diamonds from faces has retired. <laughs> <laughs> Just on the very day that she was finally coming up for operation. <laughs> okay, Rob and David, what have you got? Tony Blair. Tony, Tony Blair. Blair who... Lily, Jonathan, you've got... <laughs> Tony Blair, we've Tony seen Blair. it. Noel and Russell, you've gone for... Don't cry. <laughs> a message to the young Zoe. Just cheer her up. <laughs> Let's have a look and see. What's the matter, Zoe? Why are you crying? Because I just want Tony Blair to go back and I want to be Prime Minister. <laughs> Why? <laughs> because I just do. Why do you want him to be Prime Minister still? Because <laughs> I love him. <laughs> but there's going to be a new Prime Minister. There's going to be a new Prime Minister dying called Gordon Brown. <laughs> no! You don't want him? 